Hey guys, I uh, just want to do a quick video. I got this finally put together tonight well enough to actually show, do a video of it. So here's the box, nothing too fancy. This is uh, my second prototype. The first one was just a breadboard sitting here on the desk. Uh, so you can see here we have on the left the Z uh, up and down on the far left, the Y up and down down the center, and the X across the middle. And then we have inches and millimeters in the top right. We have two indicator lights. Green is connectivity between the Bluetooth and the computer. The orange is the button indicator press. And then we have a home set and go, zero set and go, two parking positions, and laser on and off. The laser on being low power just to locate the laser to the center of whatever piece I'm working on. Then I have three buttons here on the right, green, yellow, and red. Uh, these are planned to be hooked to a wireless relay that connects to the Arduino for the pause, start, and abort buttons. Uh, I have gotten the abort to work, uh, but I haven't finished wiring up the rest of the relay, so I'm not going to show that in this video. Uh, so I just want to show this here real quickly. So I've gotten it here kind of close to this, the front just to show you the home uh, without having to watch the entire homing cycle. So here we'll home. Okay, so now we're homed. So now using the X, Y buttons and also the two here, I can send it either a quantity of one or point one. And right now it's in inches, so it will do this. Or you can switch for fine tuning, you can switch to millimeters. And you will also hear uh, typically a beep of some sort from your computer also, including the, the yellow light whenever you have a button. And it will switch to you guys can't really probably see it moving, but you can hear it, maybe. These are very fine-tuned, so you can go back to uh, inches if you want to move around. You can set the zero, which obviously you won't be able to see it actually do any of that. But I want to show the, uh, you can send it back home. If you want to go back to the, that happens to be your zero point, or that's where you do your tool changes. You can also send it to your first park position. So for me is Z all the way up and the middle back. So this clears the whole table away from whatever work piece I'm working on to, to add a new piece or get ready to cut something or whatever. Uh, and the laser right now is disabled. I have a switch on there that switches between laser and spindle. Um, so yeah, so that's about it for the first video. Uh, if you guys have any other thoughts, uh, appreciate the feedback so far. And uh, we'll uh, see you in the next one.